No extra life. Call, Call of Duty, Black Ops 2. Nobody wants Phil's treadmill. Yeah. This is Phil, and I'm watching and waiting for somebody to buy my treadmill. Person number four on Craigslist canceled. Thanks a lot, Craig. Well, it's a bunch of fat people that don't have it, uh, the gumption yet. Yeah, they need more gumption. This is really frustrating. People keep writing and being like, when can I get the treadmill? I respond in a minute, and then they're like, oh, nah. Oh, man, I gotta do my laundry. It's almost like people just respond to everything saying that they want it. Just so that they can say, no, that's okay. Comment below if you want Phil's treadmill, because yeah. chances are you can still get it. It's Ow. like on a $100 treadmill. I'm trying to get rid of it for $30 you know. if they can pick it up today. You nobody's get no. I'm getting responses, and nobody's coming to buy it. This is bull. Phil, I'm so, oh, God. This is also exactly what it says on Phil's uh, dating profile website. Exactly, yeah. You know what? You put a treadmill up, <laughs> and nobody buys it, but everyone responds back. You Please put, go out with me. You know, I, I'm I'm perfectly fertile. Uh, I can I can make babies with my penis and my balls. Perfectly fertile. That's another <laughs> uh, side project. Yep, perfectly fertile. Your uh, hardcore band, Christian hardcore, of course. Whoa! You just blew yourself up. Did I? Yep. That's I'm a you survivor. Did. You ain't gonna give up. Hey, I just got a new uh, friend request from someone I don't know on Facebook. Thanks, YouTube. I'm sure they want a treadmill. Nope, I bet they're a YouTuber. That's my guess. There's one thing that can be said about YouTubers. They love social media. No, they don't. Get yeah, out they of here. They love it. They like their Twitters and their Vines I and their uh, to reload. Their, their Facebooks and the oh, Buzzkill. Remember that show on MTV, Buzzkill? Yeah, man. I do. It's like a prank show, only actually funny. Oh, snap. Take that, Ashton Kutcher. Yeah. There aren't a lot of funny prank shows, to be honest. Well, if it you takes were to make a lot a, for a prank to make me laugh. If you were to make a prank show, what would make it funny for you? Well, first of all, it can't be anything where it's like, that's not a prank, you're just being a jerk. Like, when people do that, it drives me nuts. But it's like, for this prank, I'm going to tell somebody that their mom is dead. It's like, no, that's not a prank. Okay, like, say a if prank. a prank were to be that uh, everyone were to comment below and say how gay Phil was. And that, use, like, see, analogies to talk about how gay Phil is. No, that's just mean. Yeah, see? that doesn't seem like a prank. That just seems like a dick move yeah, by one of his friends. Yeah, that's just totally cold. Well, I mean, you know, let's see how it plays out. I don't think that's a prank, though. Like, I, let's bully someone until they freaking go nuts. That's not... Uh, no. No, but Phil, you're not that gay. So we'll find out from no, people... I'm not gay. Not well, that there'd be anything wrong with that if I was. It would be my right, and it would be fine, but I'm not. You hang out with dudes all day. So well, that's that. true. That's I got, I've got dude friends. I'm a guy's guy. That's what people say about me. I'm a guy's guy. You should get uh, you know, other types of friends or maybe other people to do things with. Uh, What, like an activity partner? <laughs> because tonight I am doing activities with an activity partner. Oh, what We're are gonna you gonna watch Game of Thrones and laugh and talk of memories past? So who's this? Who's this person? No, no, you're no last wax. names. No last names. Huh? No it's last none names. None of your business. No first names. Screw you. Play the game. Is it a guy? No, it's a female. It's a uh, lady. You're you're gonna go on an activity partner date? Why can't you just call it a date? Yeah, I'm gonna go on a date tonight. But yeah. you're gonna do what? Watch Game of Thrones with a with a lady. That's a friend. Date, is she a date friend? Is she a friend? She's an activity partner. <laughs> what? I think it's nebulous, but it can become so much more. It can, yeah. Right now, who knows what it is? What about a finger bang, buddy? No, it's not that at all. Stop it. What? But for you, maybe she'll finger bang you. No, the, 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 <laughs> and see, be your this buddy. is why I didn't want to bring it up. Is because now, being a little rude. No way. No, you, you're being a little rude. Phil, now. you need a good finger banging. No, that's. Uh, I'm sitting on the wooden chair, and I could use a good finger banging. This oh, is man, I couldn't move forward because there was a guy in my way, and then he shot me. <laughs> oh, isn't that always the way? No, here's the perfect prank show, all right? <laughs> the perfect prank show is... Wait a minute. Is that what we were talking about? <laughs> I yeah, think we were talking about a Scott perfect... decided to just start insulting me. A perfect prank show would be called Finger Bang Buddy. And then you think you're going to go out and do stuff with your friend, and then somebody ends up grabbing you. Much like when you go to Mexico and they have the guy with the whistle and the tequila, and they force you to drink it. They yeah. forcibly finger bang you while uh, making you blow a whistle. Do you ever drink the tequila when they do that, or are you still you, where you're like, Meh, I don't have any fun because I'm Scott. I do I do hey, talk whoa. like I'm from the 30s. Yeah, Meh, see, Meh, <laughs> I don't have any fun, see? Meh, I don't care for it. Meh. Uh, Scott, you don't drink a drop of alcohol. I don't. 
you this back and forth of insults is making me uncomfortable. I'm not insulting. I'm just saying he doesn't drink alcohol. It's not an insult. No, that's what's weird about it is you guys sound like you're trying to insult each other, but you're not insulting each other. That's exactly it. Is I'm not insulting. I'm trying to get the story behind it. Yeah, Scott, you do not drink a drop of alcohol. You have. I have. I don't. Uh, as, and you made a conscious decision that you are no longer drinking alcohol. Yes. So n you're no longer anonymous. Yeah, I don't not, I don't any longer need to keep slaying people on the open road at New Year's. Right. Yes, you're done with that. Yeah. Well, you had your time. I scored all my points. I yeah. won. Just like this game. 100 points. Like Boom. You had some sort of trauma that you don't like to talk about. Yes. And you stopped. And people still like you. Boners! Yes. See? Uh, I had a trauma with boners, and I was driving my activity partner. Yeah. And uh, I brutally slayed her in the car. Yeah, with comedy. With comedy. Yeah. Not a lot of people know this, but we're actually comedians. <laughs> One would not guess. No. Yeah, they uh, would. No, they what? How? From all the finger banging. How is that something comedians do? Comedians are the opposite of that. The problem is when all, I do it, I make them laugh. Comedians all hang out with uh, members of their own sex and make jokes about uh, things to hide their pain. All comedians finger bang each other. No. Pat Oswald finger bangs Bill Cosby. No. Uh, you got the finger bang in the bond of Pat Oswald. Uh, Dane Cook finger bangs uh, Rita Rudner. I believe that. See, that's really, I bet that happened at least once. And, At uh, least once. Sam Kennison finger bangs George Carlin. And he screams the entire time. Bah! Hey, that's the game. Whoa! Oh. Hey, I win. You lose. I want to see this. Who'd I want to kill. See this. I think I killed you, buddy. No, I was alive. I shot you to death. No, right here. You shot me. That oh, grenade. There. Oh, where's the grenade going? Where? Oh, Next to a dead guy. Up. No, you nope, killed some other guy. I killed that guy. Because I that killed you. That was very random. Oh, man. Subscribe!